closed down, which I don't know how because of IV for lovers like me and my friends. But, like, not really me because, like, I loved it. I would shop online and, like, fill my card up with it. But, like, I, I would never buy it. Is anyone else like that? Like, since I don't have a debit card, since I'm only, like, 12, like, who, like, buy stuff with their card? Like, yeah. So, anywho, that was my first trend. And my second stage, not trend, because, like, no one had it. Stage was a Viva headband. Surprise, surprise. I wore Iviva headband every day, but it wasn't correctly. No, I mean, because, like, you have to be original Mason. Nothing can be correctly. Let me see if I have one, actually. Okay. Follow me. We're going to go see if we have one. So, here it is. So, this is what I wore every day. Almost. This. So, on some days, I would wear it with my hair down. This is how I, I would wear it. Just imagine me with my natural hair, like, frizzy, two times the size of this little, like, do, 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 and curly. Like this. I wonder why my headbands were always falling down, like, I didn't wear them correctly. But, like, wait, I didn't do it correctly. Oh, yeah. So cool. <laughs> it's not even, like, pulled up. Like, it's supposed to be, like... Wait, I'm, like, trying to, like, fix it. So, that was my hair down. And I wore these, like, every single day. Then with my hair up. Again. Poofy hair. And a low ponytail. I would stuff my hair, my frizzes, my bangs, under this tiny headband. I don't know. I, I don't know. My headband would be raised, like, above. Like, it would be, like, my hair would be, would be like, kind of flat because, like, my hair was, like, really poofy. I mean, it still is, but I straighten it because I didn't believe in straightening last year. Or, or the year before, or the year before. This went on for about two years. Yeah, it was, yeah. So my hair would be like flat, and then this, there, would, there would be all this hair tucked in, squeezed under my headband. So it would be like a tiny bit higher than it was supposed to be. So that's the second trend slash stage that I went to. The third was Justice. Now, like I said, Iviva was the thing. But at the beginning of the year in third and fourth grade, I was the justice queen. I had everything justice. I was like, <laughs> I'm cool. <laughs> justice queen. But really no one else had it. But like I thought that they did because like I was really only observant on myself. I still kind of am. Like I'm more observant now. So anywho, I was like really cool cool so I was like I have I'm gonna go shopping the fifth grade year like for fifth grade summer not going to not going into this year but going into the year before it's so like the fourth grade and then like the summer and then the fifth grade and I went shopping for everything just like I raided the whole store I think I spent like two hundred dollars there which was like 15 things like at, at Iviva it, it would be like three to four maybe maybe if you're like lucky like headband I, I don't know but like yeah and so like I raided the whole store but then I realized that people in fifth grade didn't really wear justice and my school ladies I'm sorry if I'm like offending anyone this is just at my school yeah but like yeah so like no one really had justice but like I was so confident I loved my clothes but then, like, people would, like, give me, like, side eyes, and I was like, I want to have Iviva. So I finally got Iviva. I was obsessed with Justice. But, like, the thing, funny thing is, I got a size 20 shirt. I was a size 10. And I still wore it, but people made fun of me. So that's when I started, like, wanting to get Iviva. 
Like, they didn't, like, no one, like, directly makes fun of you at my school. They, like, talk behind you, behind your back. Or, like, give you, like, looks. But, yeah. But, like, I realize that doesn't really matter what people think. Because, like, some people are just mean and they're jealous. They're so jealous of me. So, my fourth stage was actually kind of cool slash kind of ugly i had so wait right i had my wrist okay wrist easy wrist my wrist wait i have to like put it behind it so my wrist looks pretty even right i had like five bracelets on this i never took off i wore five bracelets straight for three years never taking them off well, well, that's not entirely true. I, I had to take them off for a cotillion. I cried. Oh, I hated it. Because I was like, I'm going to wear these till I'm um, in my 30s. Grandkids are going to ask me, what are those, Grandma? I've worn these for 50 years. <laughs> and <laughs> that was a weird voice that I just made. But, like, I finally got over them because, like, I just felt like I have to... Yeah, like, this was, like, really, like, white. I mean, I'm still really tan. Not tan. Opposite of tan. I'm pink. I'm bright. No, I'm not bright pink. I'm just pink and pale. Best combo. Woo. But, like, this was, like, kind of tan pink. And this is, like, really white. But I wore those. But, like, they were kind of cool because they had, like, meanings on them that, like, my old pr principal sent out to everyone. No one wore them but me. But, like, I was the bomb. I was so fetch. I was gnarly. I still say those words because I am so cool. <laughs> so that was the fourth trend. The last trend is absolutely the worst. Oh my god, I can't. <laughs> I will insert a picture here. Here. I know. I had bangs. Now, bangs look amazing on some people. Imagine frizzy, curly, oily, messy, curly, frizzy hair and bangs. My bangs looked like window seal. When, wait, what? Drapes. They went like this. They were supposed to go like that. And I was like, I'm going to be so cool. I will give you a little... There they are. <laughs> Drapes, honey. They were they were supposed to go like I don't know how I'm gonna do this, but like that, which isn't really better. But then I ended up like priorities them to the side, so it was like Oh, it looks so good. Anywho, I had bangs. <laughs> That was an awful trend. I don't know who possessed me to get bangs. I remember someone, like, wanted me to get bangs. I don't remember who. Like, I just love changing my hair, but, like, I can't... I have dyed it pink. Not all pink before, but just, like, these strands. These, which were bangs at the time. Someone asked me to dye my bangs pink. I was like, honey, no. <laughs> no. No, no, I shouldn't have even gotten bangs in the first place. I finally grew them out, though, so, like, that's amazing. I hated bangs. When I first got them, like, they styled, they styled them so they were, like, perfectly in place, like, straight. But, I, again, I didn't use a straightener back then, so, like, I didn't need, yeah. So, yeah, those were my five stages that I went through. Thank you so much for watching. I had so much fun looking back at these pictures and, like, thinking what a freak I was. <laughs> no, just kidding. Well, on some, kind of, I kind of was a freak. But, thank you so much for watching. Leave a big thumbs up, subscribe, leave a comment if you want to. It's a free country. I don't know what you want to do. And, yeah, thank you so much for watching and have a very, very nice day. Yeah, so, bye!